welcome to this Wings of Isis transmission, moving beyond all 3D and 4D limitations. And open body, open mind with your breath, inviting in the light of the universe with the breath on the in-breath, light from 360 degrees flowing in your body from the horizon. into all cells of the body and on the out breath releasing back to the horizon anything that doesn't serve you anything that doesn't belong to you anymore back to the light allowing more of your own natural light to return to you With your in-breath, breathing light from the stars and the sun into the body, into the cells and bones of the body. On the out-breath, releasing anything from the cells and the bones back to the universe, back to the light. Allowing more space for your own natural light to return to you. And breathing, following that cycle of breath, following that cycle of breath. Call your team and spirit, made up of all guides and helpers and angels, archangels and star races and star councils, your own higher self, your own I am presence, come be with you. And I call the archangels of the horizontal plane. Beginning in the East, with Raphael, Archangel of Air, of the Mind. The symbol of this angel is a caduceus, a crystal wand, and two golden serpents entwined around that wand, and where they meet near the top, two golden wings. Focusing on the symbol invokes the energy of the angel, which is emerald green fire. Breathing and inviting that angel to hold the space, to hold the space, to clear and hold the space. Feel the cleansing light of emerald green fire in your field. And to the south, Michael, Archangel of the Element of Fire. The symbol is a sword of light. And the energy is electric blue fire. Invite that sword of light into your energy field at the front and at the back. Protecting front and back from lower frequency interference. So to the left and to the right. Protecting you in the whole horizontal plane from low frequency interference. Placing that sword in all timelines where there's any interference or where you're touched by any low frequency energies. Past timelines, present, parallel, future. Protecting you in all timelines from lower 3D and 4D energies. And breathe and open. To the west, let's call Gabriel Archangel of Water, Messenger Angel. 
The symbol of that angel is a silver chalice. And the energy as you focus on it is diamond white fire. Invoking that fire like a waterfall of light through your field. Waterfall of light. And breathe and open. Three angels, three energies. Releasing what you need to release and opening to whatever you need to open to. And the fourth angel of the horizontal plane is Uriel, Archangel of Earth, of structure of the body. The symbol is a golden pentacle, a five-pointed star in a circle of light. As you focus on that symbol, inviting ruby red fire into your field, into the blood, tissue and organs, anywhere you're holding low frequency energies release back to the universe on the out breath. Release back to the universe. Allowing more of your own natural light to return to you. Four angels, four energies and open and open. Expanding your energy, expanding your energy. And also inviting in the vertical force plane Metatron of the great central sun. Bringing the cosmic Christ grid down into the room, sealing the room. Sealing the walls and the floor, the ceiling, the doors, the windows in golden light. Imagine that light washing through the whole structure, closing in the openings. Bring that energy down into your body from the crown, the third eye, the throat and down to the heart and anchor into the heart. Anchor that light into the heart. And breathe and aligning all chakras from the heart upwards to the great central sun. Earth below Sandophon, the diamond white crystalline grid of the Earth, bringing that light up with your breath and intention up to the feet. Allowing that light into the room. through the legs and around the legs like a rising tide up to the base that opens up to the base up to the sacral that opens and the solar plexus that opens and into the heart and anchoring in the heart
allowing all of your chakras from the heart down to align with the crystalline grid of the earth. And breathe. And six angels, six energies, and open and expand your whole field. Releasing what needs to be released, opening to new energies from the two grids. Allowing those two energies from the grids into all chakras, into all meridians, into the cells. Allowing for a rebalancing with this higher light. And into the field, let's call the goddess Isis. The goddess Isis into the space. And all beings working with her. All beings working with her. being now enfolding her wings around you great wings around you and in this frequency of energy transporting you to a temple of light beyond this time and space into a great hall Feeling the wings unfolding, so that you can stand in the hall and feel the space around you. This temple, which may have a very Egyptian feel, or perhaps otherworldly feel, or perhaps both. standing in the middle of a great hall and the energy of Isis is in the very fabric of the building the very fabric of the temple and all beings working with Isis holding you in love holding you in light
and once again beginning to feel those wings enfolding you in love, in light, once more. Feel yourself held in this cocoon of love and light. And Isis begins to send love, light to your inner child. To all of your inner children in the psyche. All parts that are fragmented or feel alone, abandoned, afraid, rejected on the inner planes. Send in love to your vulnerability. Love to the wounded parts, the conditioned parts. sending healing to those parts of you. They are not alone, they are not abandoned, they are never rejected. same time sending love to the free magical child within you, those parts which are free and magical, beyond conditioning, free and liberated. Love to those parts. And Isis sending love and light to your inner adolescent. All parts of you, the fragmented, who feel alone, abandoned, afraid, or rejected on the inner planes. Sending love to your wounded adolescent. And this part of you may have struggled with identity or sexual energy, 
growing into adulthood, sending love to those parts. The summer traumatic time. And also love to the free, curious, adventurous adolescent within, the part beyond all limitation. Sending love to that part, those parts of you. And Isis sending love light to all other parts of your ego. To other parts of the ego that need love, that need healing, that need light. Isis enfolding you and sending light to all parts of your psyche. Sending light to any old stories or meanings or beliefs or identifications that hook you into any limiting patterns. same time sending light to upgrade your sense of identity, your sense of self-image. sense of identity and self-image upgrading. And breathe and open. And 
sending love light to your bloodlines, the mother line. Purifying all pathways of ancient karma concerning limitation, any agreements or trauma, emotional imprinting, stories, beliefs. Releasing everything from the bloodline, any programming of I must, I have to, I'm obliged to, I am forced to, I am shamed into, I am prohibited from doing or experiencing. opening those pathways, clearing those lower energies. And then to the Father line, purifying all pathways of ancient karma concerning limitation, clearing any agreements or trauma or emotional imprinting or beliefs. Releasing any programming of a must, I have to, I'm obliged to, I'm forced to, I'm shamed into, I'm prohibited from doing or experiencing. Sending love light now to all external factors in this reality. To all sexual energy or sexual cording or sexual projections that keep you limited in any way. Isis sending energy to dissolve 
release all those energies. Dissolving and releasing all sexual energy or corning or projections. is sending a release of any obligation to adhere to any societal laws or guidelines that will go against your sovereign will, your sovereign energy, your sovereign mission or the sanctity of your body. release from any laws or guidelines in the 3D matrix that seek to interfere or restrict your freedom of self-expression. Sending light and love to clear any virtual platforms of any and all interference that may seek to drain or divert or harvest your energy or light in any way. Sending light and love to dissolve any adherence to any Illuminati agendas or programs that seek to limit and control your free will or the free will of the collective. now sending love light to clear and purify any interference from any lower astral forces or lower galactic forces that seek to limit your freedom or oppose you from moving along your chosen path of evolution and joyful growth. and open and Isis sending love and light to lift you from this old 3D timeline of duality of suffering of struggle and limitation lifting you to a new 5D timeline of spiritual awakening of growth through joy of freedom of unity consciousness
releasing all lower energies binding you to the 3D, 4D worlds. Lifting you to a 5D vibration of consciousness. Isis sending love light to raise the frequency of your field to the highest spectrum of growth through joy and unlimited freedom. Expanding all possibilities, all doorways of 5D opportunities. is now sending light love to open the 5D timeline so you can see and experience and feel that timeline. Feeling the full fruition of the new earth to come. just at the very beginning stages of the transition from the dark to the light. Opening the timeline so you can see further along that line to the full fruition of the new earth. Calling the energies of that new earth into your own reality now. Opening your reality to a higher flow of abundance, love, joy, growth and miraculous possibilities. Breathing and opening. And finally, if you have any personal requests for Isis, transmit that to her now. Feel the wings around you transmitting love light into your field.
into the bloodlines, into timelines, into other lifetimes, into this reality dissolving what needs to be dissolved, what's interfering with you and opening you to the new. The 5D timeline. Feeling those wings opening, opening. Feeling the space around you, the temple of light. All beings working with Isis around you, holding you. Feel a final blessing from the temple of light. guides or angels here, all ascended beings here feeling a final blessing and then the wings close around you once more, enfolding you once more. I begin to transport you from this temple of light to time-space coordinates of this reality in this physical body. back to the body 
feeling the wings of Isis still around you in the body. Gradually unfolding, gradually unfolding. Breathing. And let's thank all beings in your team and spirit of the highest light resonance, all angels holding the space, holding the grids. Allowing those grids and those energies just to begin to recede. The horizontal plane, thanking Uriel. Gabriel, Michael, Raphael. The vertical force plane, Sandophon, Metatron. Breathing and opening, allowing your energy field to adjust, adjusting to the transmission. Adjusting to transmission. And this transmission is offered to you, as always, with love and blessings, love and blessings. <laughs> 